Yo, 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 what's going on Team Twitter? I hope you're all super well today. Well, I thought there was a possibility that I was going to be playing a game for the team I've been trialing for, but if you watched Friday's vlog, I got the news that I wasn't going to be playing. Now, of course, I was upset, I was frustrated, I really want to play, not just to show that I can bring value to this team, but because I want to get out on the field, man. I want to play football, that's what I do, that's what I love. When I'm not doing that, it is a little bit annoying. So, look, if you are new around here, make sure you go down below and click that subscribe button so you do not miss a video. But because I'm not playing, we can either sit here and dwell on it and go, I wish I was playing, I wish I was playing. Or you can get up and get to work. Now, yes, getting out to the park is going to improve you, all of that sort of stuff, but I've said it before, escapism is what it helps me with. So it helps me deal with my emotions. So I'll be going to the park with Jack and Sam. Really the main focus for today will be some 1v1s, fitness orientated as well. And I'll get them down as well because we'll have a laugh, it'll take my mind off things and I'll be able to kind of refocus. So yeah, that's going to be the plan. We're going to go down to the park, chat with them, and we may go to the pool. I messaged them seeing if they're interested. It sounded like they were. I'm not quite sure yet. So after the session, you may see us at the pool. Maybe not. I don't know. Woo, we got the boys. Ah. Sammy, showing the fire. Look at those. Have you done... Now, when I first saw these, we got them together. Well, I went to the shops with yeah, you. Yeah, we were pretty much on a date. <laughs> Have you done any of the lace techniques? Yeah, I have actually. W what have you improved? Um, I basically just uh, made the lace configuration a bit more skinny so I can have a, a more wide uh, platform area. And also I've gone for an interlocking uh, situation Oh my here. god, you have to. <laughs> I, interlocking situation for more agility on the ball. <laughs> give us a look. Point your foot down. So that is going to give you more agility on the ball. Yeah. Jack, what do you reckon? of the uh, lace configuration. Do you Honestly, think it's going to help him? I mean, not really. Like, boots are boots. Just get a pair, use them. <laughs> What's with all the lace techniques? I mean... Coming from all, someone <laughs> who just has, like, eight holes. <laughs> Any response? No, he can't. He can't. Look at, all the, look at that. Yeah. Look at, it's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. It's not that funny. So from the football tennis, we then moved into some 1v1s now. It may look as if, you know, we're not sprinting around and it's not super intense, but keep in mind that this is fitness orientated as well. So we work hard, we have a little rest, we work hard and we get fatigued. That's the whole goal of it. Now, I've included some first person footage for you guys. So if you want to see more of that in the future, let me know down in the comments because I think it's really cool to see it from, you know, our perspective. And yeah, let me know down in the comments. That's coming up after this clip that you're seeing right now. Yeah, that's it really. No, 
Ya san. Oh! You touched that. Session done. Sam, Jack's in the back. Hey boys. <laughs> we're off to the pool now because we want to get a bit of recovery in. Always making sure that we're looking after our bodies. Isn't that right, Jack? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also going to try and teach these guys backflips. No, no you. you already know how. Just <sighs> what? <Do> you... <laughs> I don't think you do. I do. Okay, I'll so you're going to do. I'll do a backflip before you teach me. All right. I'll do a front flip. Wait, can you front flip? Yeah, not on ground. Oh no, but in a pool. Of course. Oh, I find that a little bit harder. Oh. from the pool I've showered man I feel so much better after that pool session body mind it all feels refreshed I know I just show you guys us jumping off the cliff and stuff like that but I feel like that's a bit more exciting than you know watching us in the pool doing the stretches and whatever else we do in the pool because you know I want to keep these vlogs interesting man anyway dinner bang have a look at that we got it looks like chicken schnitzel and we got sweet potato and normal potato roasted and then some snow peas and asparagus. That is looking pretty damn good. I'm hungry, I'm gonna crack on with this. Good session as well, I was happy with it. I think if I had my time again, maybe, I don't know, because I really wanted to do 1v1s. I wanted to push myself there, get a little bit of fitness out of it as well. But maybe we could have done one small passing drill, but I don't know, it doesn't really matter. The time we spent doing 1v1s was, Really, really good. Pushed each other and, you know, we're, we're improving all the time. Right, time for me to head off to bed. I'm super interested to hear from you guys. Let me know down in the comments how many of you go down to the pool and incorporate it into your recovery process or do you just stick with 
foam rolling and stretching? Do you just do stretching? Do you do nothing at all? Let me know down in the comments because man, I feel so much better after getting out in the salt water. It's decently cold. It helps the muscles recover, the body, the mind, everything. So yeah, that's just my thoughts on it. I suggest if you guys haven't incorporated it into your sort of recovery process, go out there, do it. If possible, if not, then yeah, I don't know. I know it's snowing in England at the moment, so I don't know, you could go in the snow if you wanted. Anyway, get out of the vlog there, team 20, I'm signing out. Make sure you like and subscribe, join the journey, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.